Hey, this is David Hood here in South Bend, Indiana for the Sports Talk Radio Network. What happened tonight, Dabo Sweeney called it an ass-kicking at Notre Dame Stadium. The Fighting Irish knock off number four Clemson 35 to 14. In a game that, that really almost from the outset just wasn't competitive. Notre Dame blocks a punt early. They return at 17 yards for a touchdown. They were the more physical team. They were the better coach team, something that Swinney alluded to. In his post-game press conference, the Tigers were down 21-0 when they decided to take starting quarterback DJ Uwe Angalale out of the game. They inserted Cade Klubnik, but the Tigers were at their seven-yard line. He throws an interception. Next thing you know, it's 28-0. And the Irish just keep pounding the football. Clemson added two touchdowns late, but it was in garbage time. There really wasn't a lot that you could take away from that. It's just a total domination, all three phases of the game by the Fighting Irish. They won on offense, they won on defense, they won in special teams. As Dabo said, hey, it was an ass kicking. So the Tigers now have to find a way to regroup. As Dabo said, they want to win the ACC Atlantic, not just high for it, not kind of going back door. That means winning next week against Louisville, even though they've clinched. They still want to go out on the field and win a football game uh, for the ACC Atlantic. So that's what they've got on their plate next, but it's also what happens with the quarterback situation? DJ Uyangule came out to talk to us in post game. He didn't look confident. His head was down. You can tell that stuff is bothering him. Is there a quarterback controversy? Will there be a change? What kind of answers will the Tigers have this week? All oh, we'll have to find out as the Tigers take on Louisville next Saturday at 3.30 on Military Appreciation Day. This is David Hood for the Sports Talk Radio Network.